Remember the time when I bought a baguette in Paris, only to realize it was longer than my entire arm span? Talk about getting more than you bargained for. Picture this, me juggling this giant loaf causing a Parisian spectacle. But enough about my bread-based blunders, let's dive into the top 10 things to do in the city of love. Starting off our countdown at number 10, visiting the iconic Eiffel Tower. Now this isn't just your average skyscraper. The Eiffel Tower, standing tall since the late 19th century, is a testament to the prowess of human engineering. From its pinnacle, the city of love unfurls below in a breathtaking panorama that's sure to leave you spellbound. And let's not forget its historical charm that has graced countless postcards and photographs. So, if you're not afraid of heights, the Eiffel Tower is a must-see. At number 9, we have the world-renowned Louvre Museum. The Louvre isn't just a museum, it's a treasure trove of human history, a cultural hub that spans centuries and continents. Imagine walking through its grand halls, each step echoing with the stories of those who came before us. You'll find yourself in awe of the vast collection of over 35,000 works of art and historical artifacts. From Egyptian antiquities to Greek and Roman sculptures, the Louvre has it all. And let's not forget the Lady of the Hour, the captivating Mona Lisa, with her enigmatic smile that has puzzled visitors for centuries. But the Louvre isn't just about the artwork, it's about the experience of being immersed in the heart of human creativity and ingenuity. It's about the thrill of exploring the labyrinthine galleries, each turn revealing a new marvel. Remember, the Louvre is huge, so don't expect to see everything in one day. Coming in at number 8, we recommend indulging in some authentic French cuisine. Now let's turn the spotlight on Paris's gastronomical delights. Imagine starting your day with a buttery, flaky croissant from a local boulangerie, freshly baked and warm to the touch. Then, for the daring foodies, escargot awaits. These savory snails, usually served in a mouth-watering garlic and parsley sauce, are a quintessential French dish you simply can't miss. As the day winds down, treat yourself to the rich, delectable coq au vin, a traditional dish where chicken is slow cooked in red wine. And then, for the cherry on top, or should we say the caramel on top, a creamy creme brulee with a satisfyingly crackly top layer is the perfect way to end your culinary journey. Paris is a treasure trove of flavors waiting to be discovered. Just remember the baguettes can be deceptively long. At number 7, take a leisurely stroll along the River Seine. Ah, the River Seine, the lifeblood of Paris, a serene ribbon of water that meanders through the heart of the city. As you saunter down the cobblestone paths, the city's rich history unfolds before your eyes. From the vintage bookstalls of the Bouquinistes to the imposing Gothic masterpiece that is Notre Dame, every step is a revelation. The city's iconic landmarks like the Eiffel Tower and the Louvre peek out from behind the leafy trees, their reflections dancing on the water's surface. Listen carefully, and you'll hear the gentle lullaby of the river, the distant chime of cathedral bells, the soft murmur of conversations, punctuated by the occasional laughter. The Seine is not just a river, it's a storyteller, a keeper of secrets, a silent observer of the city's vibrant life. And when the city lights start to twinkle, the river transforms into a magical mirror, reflecting the city's soul. It's the perfect spot for a romantic walk or a picnic. Number 6 on our list is shopping on the Champs-Élysées. Now, you might be thinking, shopping? Really? But trust me, the Champs-Élysées is no ordinary shopping strip. It's a two-kilometer-long avenue of pure retail bliss. As you stroll down this iconic boulevard, you'll be greeted by a stunning array of shops and boutiques. On one side, you'll find high-end fashion brands like Louis Vuitton and Chanel, where you can indulge in the latest Parisian trends. On the other, you'll discover charming souvenir stores packed with unique trinkets and treasures that are quintessentially French. From trendy boutiques to vintage bookstores, from perfume parlors to chocolate shops, the Champs-Élysées has something for everyone. It's a shopping paradise in the heart of Paris, a place where fashion, culture, and history intersect in the most delightful way. So go ahead, shop till you drop. Just don't forget to leave some room in your suitcase. And finally, rounding out our top five activities in Paris. First off, we have a visit to the Notre Dame Cathedral. This iconic structure is a masterpiece of French Gothic architecture and is a must-see for any visitor. While the outside is a sight to behold, don't forget to step inside and see the breathtaking stained glass windows and the grand organ. Next on our list is the Bohemian neighborhood of Montmartre. 
This hilltop district is known for its artistic history and the famous Sacre Coeur Basilica. Wander the cobblestone streets, visit the local art studios, and don't miss the chance to get your portrait sketched by one of the many artists in Place du Tertre. Third, we recommend attending a cabaret show at the Moulin Rouge. This world-renowned venue offers an unforgettable night of glitz, glamour, and high-energy performances. It's a mesmerizing spectacle that's sure to keep you on the edge of your seat. Our fourth suggestion is a boat tour on the River Seine. It's an incredible way to see the city's landmarks, including the Eiffel Tower, the Louvre Museum, and the Pont des Arts. Whether you choose a daytime tour or a romantic evening cruise, it's a unique perspective of the city that you won't soon forget. Lastly, but certainly not least, indulge in some people watching at a sidewalk cafe. This quintessential Parisian pastime is the perfect way to relax after a day of sightseeing. Order a cafe au lait, sit back and watch the world go by. So there you have it folks, we've journeyed through art galleries, feasted in foodie heaven, relaxed by the riverside, shopped to our heart's content, and wrapped it all up with an unforgettable top 5. But remember, this is just a taste of what Paris has to offer. And there you have it, the top 10 things to do in Paris. But remember, no matter what you choose to do, the most important thing is to have fun and embrace the Parisian way of life. So to sum it all up, Paris is a city where you can joust with jumbo baguettes and scale lofty towers. It's a place that keeps you, quite literally, on your toes. Now, I want to hear from you. What's your favorite thing to do in Paris? Drop a comment below and don't forget to like and subscribe for more travel tips and adventures. Au revoir, mes amis.